environmentally friendly institution of all time, the petrodollar. Bitcoin requires no warplanes to sustain it, no Middle East peace wars, no drone fleets, no multi-billion dollar armament deals. Like the internet itself, it just works. A green machine and a peer-to-peer -peer protocol for money in the network age. The F-35 will only ever run on jet fuel. It's never going to be clean, ever. Whereas Bitcoin plugs into the wall and whatever's on the other side of that plug is what Bitcoin is. And it won't be long, not more than a decade max, where Bitcoin is 100% powered by renewables and waste. This conversation, really the fundamentals of it, is people that think Bitcoin is useful versus people who think Bitcoin is not useful. If you think it's useful and appreciate its use cases, you quickly realize that its energy consumption is nothing. And on the contrary, I worry about the energy consumption being too low. I want to go to sleep knowing that somebody has to overtake the Argentinian grid to manipulate my money. I probably won't be happy until Bitcoin uses as much energy as America. We're still a fair ways away from that, but that's when I'll be truly happy knowing that Bitcoin, like, no one can touch it.